Now that you've unpacked your Hyrule Hydra, let's get it set up. First, we want to make sure that the power button is in the up, flush, out, or off position. And the emergency stop, we want to make sure is engaged. This cuts off power to all the motors and heating elements. The third safety we have is back here on the power entry module. This is actually a circuit breaker also, and we want this in the down or off position. Then we're going to take our cord, we're going to plug into a 15 amp circuit, and we're going to plug into the hydra and then into the wall. Once that's complete, we're going to trip the circuit breaker or the power entry module into the on position. Then we're going to come over and depress the power button and it should be illuminated showing that there is power and then we can come turn the lights on and there's lights in the chamber and the last thing that we're going to do is we're going to rotate the emergency stop clockwise and you can hear that the motors and the heating elements are now powered okay next step you're going to take your USB-B cable from your computer and plug it into the appropriate port on the circuit board and you should hear it connected on the printer all right now Repetrol is loaded we're going to kind of come over here to our com link tab and we show com4 we're going to select it sometimes it shows up in the corner over here uh, 38.4 is the correct rate we're going to apply then we're going to ping and now it shows that a printer is connected so we should be able to do some movement let's drop the bed down you want to show the bed dropping down? I'll make sure the heads go to home. Send them out to the parking position. And then back to home. So this shows us that the printer is connected. It's operating properly. The, the program is communicating with the, with the circuitry in here. And it's doing what we tell it to do. The next step would be making sure that your bed's level. At the top of your controller, in addition to the power button and the lights, uh, the run button is if you're resuming after a pause in your print, you want to come over here and make some adjustment and resume your print. That's the same as the play or resume button during your print on your program. So these buttons for the vacuum in the air go to a relay, which will have a turn on or off power to a different power supply to which you can plug in your negative or positive air pressure device. Well that's all for today from the lair of the Hydra. Tune in next time when we'll go over more fascinating details.